making today? Stress balls! Not just any stress balls, we are making Orby stress balls. The best stress balls ever. Daddy, this is a lot of things make. Do you like Orbeez? <laughs> Do you like Orbeez? Huh? <laughs> These are really, really easy to make and this is how we did it. To make our Orby stress balls, we are using these jelly beads that I found on Amazon. I will leave a link down below. And we just put them in this big bowl with a bunch of water so that they can expand. These sat overnight so they are nice and big and ready to go. And you can just follow the directions on the back. They do make a lot more than you think they're going to make. So just be aware of that. But it's always fun to have leftovers. My kids have loved playing with them. Winston likes to hide his toys in there and find them. So they've been a lot of fun. They're also fun for spas. For spas, yeah. So like you feed them. And yeah, you like to hide your toys in there. I just like put my hands in them. Yeah, that's why to make a stress ball out of these is like the very, very best because they're so fun to squish. And if they pop, they won't be so messy. Right. We also made slime out of these Orbeez and that was a lot of fun. The kids absolutely loved it. I will leave a link down below if you want to do that as well. Okay, so the other things that you're going to need for your stress balls are translucent balloons or you can use any color, but if you want to see the Orbeez through, you're going to want to use translucent. And the only ones we could find have little white polka dots, but I thought that that was cute. They look like Orbeez kind of. Yeah, they look yeah. like Orbeez, so I think that that works great. You're also going to need a water bottle, and I tried just using a funnel to funnel them in, but it doesn't work, and I will show you why. So a, an empty water bottle is perfect for this. And also a funnel and a scoop to put the Orbeez into your water bottle. So we're gonna start by doing that. Bailey, do you wanna hold the bottle? And I'll scoop them in. And the funnel, and yep, Gage can scoop in. Okay, you can scoop some in too. <laughs> Just put it right in there. Oh, we're all over the counter. <laughs> okay, we're gonna pick it up like that. There we go. Can I put some in? Okay, you do one more, and then it will be Gage's turn. I also love filling our stress balls with these Orbeez because. If they do pop, which is my biggest fear when we make stress balls, at least they're just Orbeez and they're really easy to clean up rather than no, like flower. The, yeah, flower or the inside of a diaper. So these are really actually they're fun. perfect for stress balls. After you get your Orbeez into your water bottle, the next thing we're going to do is blow a little bit of air into our balloon. You don't need a lot. And then you're going to take the top and you're going to twist it. And the reason that we are using a water bottle instead of a funnel is because we want to leave that air in there so that the Orbeez are able to fall into the balloon. If you just use a funnel, when you hook this onto there, all the air is going to come out. Yeah. So you want to leave it twisted and then you're going to open this up, the top of the balloon, and you're going to put it around the water bottle. Okay, and then let it unwind. And then you're gonna let the Orbeez just go right into the balloon. That's so cool. Oh. Just like that. Woo, so cool. is that cool? <laughs> okay, and then just tie it. I'm gonna do like a double knot so we can cut the end off and just make sure it's really, really secure. And then I'm just going to cut that end off. And the stress ball is ready to go. So you can see all the Orbeez in there and it does look really cute with the polka dots. You like that? You want it? There you go. Okay, do you guys want to make one? Yeah. All right, talk down for a second. Yeah, you can make one in just a second. Okay, I'll go first. All right. You guys can help each other.
that is it for our Orbeez stress balls. They're really fun and easy to make like you saw. We would love to see pictures if you guys try these. <laughs> so please send them our way on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you